just a 45 minute drive southeast of Esperance in the heart of the Cape Le Grand National Park lies five kilometers of Australia's whitest beach, Lucky Bay. There's never been a better time to get outside and enjoy this beautiful environment. With summer right here upon us, it's the perfect time to get outside with your family and friends and enjoy maybe some beach or maybe do some four wheel driving. Even though this is a relatively easy beach to access, it's important to know your car is up to the task. To make sure I have a handle on it, I'm meeting up with Chris from Western Four Wheel Driver. Well, Joe, Western Four Wheel Driver magazine's been part of the WA landscape for the last 30 plus years. And we just love telling the stories of great destinations around the state and where people can go and explore. And we really love just sharing those stories and encouraging people to get out and have a good time and, and see this amazing state that we've got. I know Western Four Wheel Driver encourages responsible beach driving, so what are some of the things that people should know? Well Joe, simple things like making sure you know how to drop tyre pressure, that you've got the, the right recovery equipment on board, you know how to recover, and if you're doing a lot of beach driving then making sure your vehicle's fully equipped for it and so you're not damaging the vehicle. So something like installing a transmission oil cooler, for instance, will ensure that your vehicle's not working as hard when it's in the sand, and in the long run, it will protect the engine and protect the, your investment in your vehicle. Right, so how does it actually work as we go through some really soft yeah, sand? It's a little bit boggy here, <laughs> getting a bit sandy. It reduces the, the overall transmission oil temperature, which increases the longevity of that, that transmission fluid. So Chris, we're out on the sand now. What do we need to look out for? Well, the beach is always, it's a very dynamic place. So the landscape's always changing as the tide's coming in. There's flotsam being pushed up onto the beach. So making sure that we're not going to hit something that's been washed ashore. Uh, poles that have been formed. Obviously wildlife. Wildlife, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Kangaroos jumping out or, or even other beachgoers and vehicles as well. Yeah. So, okay, I've protected my transmission. Is there anything else I should be looking out for? Protecting your engine is the most critical thing because that's the most valuable part of the vehicle. So making sure that you've got a pre-fuel filter, for instance, to make sure that you're going to filter out any water or sludge that, the, um, that builds up in your fuel tank. Mm -hmm. And even something like an air oil separator, otherwise known as a catch can, that prevents oil being fed back into the turbo of your, your engine and building up gunk and, and damaging the engine. Lucky Bay regularly finds itself topping the list of Australia's best beaches, and it's not hard to see why. Now, if you're looking to head out on a four-wheel driving expedition of your own, make sure your car is fully geared up before you go and grab yourself a copy of Western Four-Wheel Driver magazine. If you need any more info, just check out the website.